guys, how's it going? Corporate Cappy back here with another unboxing on the WWE Unboxing Series on No Holds Barred Wrestling Podcast. What I got for you today is a Heritage, uh, first on for Heritage set for 2017. This is first on the channel for uh, any of us. Uh, we don't. I don't usually collect Heritage, but I went to my local Walmart today. I actually looked for baseball cards, but uh, they didn't have any of those, and I saw one box of this Heritage set, so I decided to pick it up. Um, like I said, I don't usually collect Heritage. This is the first time actually opening any product from Heritage. Not a big fan of the set, but we'll uh, crack it open and see what we get. Uh, we'll open up for one for you on the channel here. Don't expect us to open any more of this product. Uh, we usually collect the top base set, and uh, one day maybe we'll open an undisputed box, but we'll see. So, um, same blaster box as uh, Tops 2017, except... Uh, I believe this one only has seven packs in it, plus a bonus relic card, and it feels, I don't know, hopefully it's not that crappy ass patch card that I've seen people get, four, five, six, seven, so we got seven base, base packs, guys, and then the one bonus relic card to open afterwards, so, we'll get right into it, um, I, I just don't really like the heritage base cards, uh, I'm not a big fan of them. Um, I really like the look of top twenty uh, top base set cards. I think those are really awesome. But I don't really have any heritage cards, so I thought I might as well at least open one. Bret Hart, Mr. Perfect. Oh yeah! All right, this box is worth it. My girl Trish Stratus Legend card. We'll set that one right there. Scott Hall. Oh man, what a pack! Alexa Bliss rookie card. Awesome. All right, so we'll set that there. Two girls right there, John Cena Tribute, John Cena, no, no, I'm not a big fan of these cards, but uh, there's Finn Balor and Undertaker. So, I mean, I can't complain about that start for uh, base cards, I guess you could say. Oh my god, what a, st okay, I don't think I can get any, any better base cards than that. Those are my three favorites right there. Alexa Bliss, Trish Stratus, and Sasha Banks as far as base cards, so we'll just put those right there. So, Kofi Kingston, Alicia Fox, Ember Moon, Future Stars. I guess that's kind of cool, the throwback Future Stars look. Dolph Ziggler. Ooh, a Shinsuke. I believe that's a bronze of Shinsuke Nakamura, rookie. Kane, Randy Orton, and Mankind. So, I really hope I don't get one of those crappy patch cards that I've been seeing people get. Uh, those are just god-awful tops. You really need to stop making those because those are just a waste of time. And nobody deserves to get those. Those are just horrendous. Rowdy Roddy Piper, Lex Luger, Zack Ryder, Natty, John Cena, Ric Flair, Dolph Ziggler, Lundra Blaze, and Jim the Anvil Nightheart. So, it's very rare for us to get WWE product up here at our Walmarts. And if we have them, there's maybe one or two boxes left. Uh, this is the only one they had. So, I don't see us getting any more in. And I don't see myself buying any more of this set anyway so Roddy Roddy Piper Stone Cold Tommaso Ciampa Rookie Bob Backlund Mick Foley AJ Styles there's a nice one I think that's a bronze that's a good one to get Sheamus Bret Hart and Stone Cold I know you guys have probably seen the base cards about a thousand times so I'm just gonna quickly go through those get rid of this crap Becky Lynch The Miz Andre the Giant, Ken Shamrock, Ron Simmons, X-Pac, RVD, another Randall Keith Orton, and Brock Lesnar, Suplex. Wow, that's a shocker. So two more packs for the Relic. Uh, so we've got Maurice, Heath Slater, Daniel Bryan, Triple H, Goldberg, Roman Reigns, Bronze. I'll just toss that one out of there. Charlotte, Edge. Anybody wants that Roman card, let me know. I'll pick it up from the floor. Alright, there's a Bailey All-Star Rookies. Well, too bad she's not really an All-Star anymore, the way she's getting pushed. The Deo Tommy, Future Stars, Charlotte Flair, Enzo, Sheamus, uh, another John Cena Tribute, Typhoon, Mick Foley, and Shawn Michaels. That's it for base cards. 
And let's get into the bonus relic. Oh my god, I'm really hoping it's not. I see the Daniel Bryan tribute card already right through the, the box here. So, that's on the front. I really hope it's not a crappy patch, guys. Oh my god, it looks like it's a patch. We'll see. Okay, so the Daniel Bryan relic. And oops, let's go with that. And our hit is a Samoa Joe Authentic Matt Relic from NXT. Oh, that's awesome. That's from NXT. <laughs> that's from NXT TakeOver Toronto, which Kyle Masters and I were at. Oh, there goes Sasha. We were at this event. This was take, taking place in Toronto, so that's awesome. That's when he won the title from, Sh from Shinsuke Nakamura. So that's pretty cool. Numbered out of 199. I'll take that any day over one of those crappy patch cards. And Joe, one of the rising stars in Universal Title Picture right now. So that's awesome. So I will take that. And Samoa Joe from the event that we were at. So that's even more special to us here at the podcast. So guys, thanks a lot for watching. If you liked it, hit that thumbs up. And hopefully uh, more unboxings to come in the future. And this is Corporal Cappy signing out.